Hello everyone and welcome back to Elite Dangerous. I'm here at Nambi Kuara at Lukyanenko Terminal and I have decided on a purpose. I've done some trading in the meantime, but my new purpose is going to be to unlock the Permit for Soul system. I can't actually go to Earth right now uh, because Soul System requires a permit to, uh, to unlock and so I'm going to aim for that and at this system I have found I, what I think is the contract to get to that point. Now I'm flying a Type 6 transporter, I left my hauler behind, it's still uh, out at Kakandi. So I'm using this Type 6 transporter which is mainly for trading and also for planetary landing practice. I've landed on planets a few times already but I haven't done anything too exciting there. Uh, so I don't know if this is a good ship to do the contracts with. Let's see, the bulletin board as I understand it, the Earth is under the control of the Federation, and so we need to be good with the Federation. I don't know uh, if I pick a faction, whether that will undo it, for instance. So I'm going to be good with the Federation Navy right now. But then, let's say later I decide to uh, pick one of the other factions to ally with, because I haven't uh, done the power play thing yet. I haven't picked uh, somebody to ally with. And I don't know if that will then prevent me from going to Earth? Not sure. But anyway, I'm going to go with this. Uh, this says promotional, uh, promotion opportunity with the Federation Navy Auxiliary. And I think that's what I need to do. Um, so it says uh, they have a fast track program and uh, tasked with missions that the regular Navy cannot be seen taking on. <laughs> okay. Okay, and then uh, some of it is attacking our traditional foe, the Empire. Now, saying that, it strikes me that that, that doesn't seem to be a good thing for a, for a Type 6 transporter to take on. However, this is a simple task, they say, and the rank required is a trade rank, Peddler. I've got 26 minutes and rank progression recruit, and I need to go to Navigator Terminal. And well, well, let's see. Okay, so I've accepted that, and we'll see what this entails. Not entirely sure. Haven't done this before. This is an expensive ship. This is a lot more expensive than the hauler, though with less expensive equipment. Okay, so where are we going? Secrets must remain secret. Navigator terminal. Okay, and. This is a pretty busy system. There's a lot of stuff here. Danvers Station, Palmer Holdings, Checkpoints, Tepper Base, some inheritance there, Extraction Sites, Humphreys City, Shirley City, Navigator Terminal. There we go. Alright, so let's head on over there and see what's up. Maybe, maybe I should purchase a Cobra Mark III or something. Uh, I did pre-order um, Horizons, so I do have access to the Cobra Mark IV if I want that. So maybe I should get that, though as I understand it's a heavier thing, not quite as nimble as the Mark III, but maybe more in line with what I need as a sort of trader. It also has more, more um, mounting points for different equipment. Okay, well, on we go. What a planet, huh? But we have to get around it. Hmm. Frameshift drive charging. Four, three, two, one, engage. I haven't got it active right now, but I actually uh, got a voice attack and an HCS voice pack for the long trips because it gets pretty lonely when you're exploring. And so you can do voice commands and it has little witty comments sometimes. And so maybe that'll make things a little bit more interesting as I go along. Well, planetary landings will make ex exploring a lot more interesting too. 
especially far out where uh, I'm I don't know if I'm gonna get shot at I don't know if past the normal habitable area where we have stations whether there'll still be people trying to shoot at me not sure if I uh, you know if I land somewhere and I don't think so I think uh, there won't be many outposts there might be resources to pick up but not much else I haven't done any in situ resource utilization yet that's something you can do with the SRVs the surface reconnaissance vehicles I look forward to uh, finding finding resources like that but it seems a little bit difficult it's certainly a lot more difficult than uh, you know just mining which I haven't also done but you can't mine these resources that you find on planets so and there is a frame shift drive boost thing and if we take a look here so in the inventory we have this synthesis thing and this FSD injection which gives you a longer range on your on your jump drive I wonder if these uh, Federation Navy auxiliary missions will be linked up in other words where I'll get the next one at navigator terminal or whether I'd have to find it somewhere else not sure I don't know the the lighting on the rings always bugs me I somehow feel and on these 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 ring gaseous plants in general but the rings uh, on the rings in particular I feel like the lighting on those could be improved. Okay, navigator terminal. Let's see what sort of place this is. Okay, I think I'll just auto dock since I have the docking system here for the sake of simple trading. I'll obviously dump the standard docking computer when I go exploring because it just takes up space. It's always interesting to see how the automated docking Landing procedure goes. Deployed. Except for the Blue Danube. That's... They, they need a mix of different... different uh, docking music. Seems to want to go straight down and then level out like this. And then use the thrusters like that. Docking successful. Engines disengaged. Interesting. Not generally the way I go. Okay, secrets must remain secret. Give cargo. All right. Um. Well, promotion opportunity with the Federal Navy Auxiliary. Let's see this now. Rank prog progression recruit. Stolen algae. Uh, enough to destroy their ability to support full warfare. In this case, we also don't want to start a shooting war. Disrupt their economy by supplying nine stolen casters of algae to their black market in Navigator's Terminal. So, I have to find this algae somewhere? I mean, we're at Navigator Terminal. Okay, so I have to... I have to find it. Where do I get stolen algae from? Black market stolen algae. There was another... Another promotion opportunity thing. Hmm. Was there another one? Thought there had been. I just saw one. I don't think this was the best mission I could have picked up. All right, well, uh, black market stolen algae, fine. Jeez, what a weird request. Okay, here we go, Aldrin Market. And this is in Fincien. All right, very good. I will uh, plot route to that one. It's got a nice little Earth-like planet, water-based life and all that. Uh, there might be other opportunities for a black market here. Yeah, there's... Uh, this DOI Enterprise, this Heli Hub, this June Long Orbital. Yeah, this place is full of black markets, so one of them must have some algae, right? Let's hope. Alright, I'm off to Fincien.
Now, I'm not too sure about this whole hauling stolen goods thing. I haven't done it before. Now, I do know we get scanned pretty regularly outside of stations. So I'm gonna have to look up what the command to drop all cargo is, so I can do that on a moment's notice. Uh, let's take a look at the controls here. Jettison all cargo end. That's appropriate. Okay. Okay, Aldrin Market, which is apparently a hive of scum and villainy. At least it has a black market. Granted. Okay. That's good. Let's let her take it in. Okay, be careful of that ring, autopilot. Not sure how safe it is around rings like that. Anyway, uh, in a bout of curiosity, a rare bout of curiosity, when it comes to looking at wikis and web pages that discuss games, because I don't usually like to look things up like that. I usually like to figure it out from the game itself, but I wanted to know how long I have before I will get access to Soul System if I continue doing this. And apparently I have to be a petty officer with the Federation. And uh, so right now I'm a recruit, and that one mission got me to recruit 24%. But it was a pretty darn simple mission. So hopefully I'll get more from this slightly more complicated mission. After recruit is cadet, then midshipman, then petty officer. So it's uh, the fourth rank up is where I have to be to get access to soul system. We are on the right track, and it's just a question of how many missions it'll take before I get to the proper rank. Especially since I'm not doing combat. And there's also the question about whether I will have to do combat missions in order to satisfy it. Not sure. Not sure if the missions they offer are dependent on what ship you have, or whether I'll have to switch ship, switch, switch ships, uh, whether I want to or not. So that's a question. Okay, let's see about this black market. Okay, uh, probably under contacts. Yeah, there it is. Uh, no, I wanted to buy illegal goods. This is annoying. How do I get the algae? Do I already have the algae? No. Oh, I guess I have to actually shoot somebody carrying algae? Oh, forget that. Yeah. Um, Alright, so no penalty for that one. Good. Cause that was just that was just not gonna happen. Um, can you give me a different mission? Well, I don't know if this is the right place. Let me head back over to the system I was in to try and find a new mission. This is revolutionary Fincian Democrats. I don't know if they're they're quite as tight with the F Federal Navy Auxiliary. Okay, well, I'm back here at Navigator Terminal, and, well, I don't see any sort of Federation, Federal Navy Auxiliary thing, mission. So, perhaps canceling that mission wasn't the best of ideas, but I don't see how I could have done it. Well, not with this ship. But if I had another ship, I guess I'd have to go hunting for somebody with algae? I don't know how that works. Maybe, uh, I haven't done this before, after all. So, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, well, look around and uh, wait for a uh, mission. Until then, I'm going to do some trading. There's this good uh, haulers needed to deliver mineral, mineral extractors to Bile Tan. And I've got enough uh, space for that, and it pays pretty well. And we'll see where we go from there. I will update you. Uh, but for now, this is my new purpose in Elite Dangerous, at least until I get this done. I want to see Soul System, and I will post updates when they are available. So on that note, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time.